Hello, welcome to this super short video on how to pull historical figures for the global stock indices. Okay, so without wasting any of your time, you go on insert menu in your Excel 2016. You click on get headings and uh, you type in here Nigerian market data and you search and then it pops up you click on hard uh, don't be put off by the name Nigerian market data because I'm in Nigeria and I created it it has a lot more Nigerian content so that's why I gave it that name but then the stock indices are global so you know the S&P the Dow Jones even the European ones the well, it has a, also a lot of Nigeria uh, of, of African stock egg stock exchange indices so once you click on add and then under the home menu you will see it's been installed you will see it here in a drama market data and you click to launch it and uh, once it comes up you will see stock indices right so anywhere in your excel you click and then you come back here and uh, you can click yesterday and instantly it's going to pull out for you you know all the major stock indices in the world and the what they closed at you know the day before today so you see about 46 of them right and across countries continents see this is Chinese Shanghai and then you know you see the Nasdaq the Russell the, uh, the London FTSE and uh, also there's the Nigerian you know I'm not going to skip my country so that's uh, one part of it what if you want to compare this with say maybe five years ago three years ago four years ago but then let me use for instance uh, a couple of months ago right so December 12 you notice the way I'm writing the date right so I'm starting with a single apostrophe because I don't want Excel to reformat there is a specific format this program requires right four letters for the year I, I think two letters for the for the month and then I think two letters for the for the day and then you select and you go back here but this time around highlighted date and then boom it's done right so thank you